there, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Katie and in this video, I'm going to be talking about how I was able to adopt or sponsor an inmate and how you can do the same. So my friend Ro, who was on season seven of 60 Days In, the same show that my boyfriend Dante was on, she was advertising on her Instagram that you could adopt an inmate and essentially what adopting an inmate means is you can put money on their books if you want to you can send them books from Amazon you can send them emails do video visits or do the old-school snail mail sending care packages whatever essentially the jail will allow and in this case after talking with Ro I had the opportunity to sponsor a young lady that was actually at Henry County Jail with Roe while she was on the show on 60 Days In, which really meant a lot to me just because as you guys know, my boyfriend Dante was on that show. You may know him as Darius. And it just meant a lot to be able to sponsor an inmate that was actually there. And especially with the holidays and everything coming up, it's a really tough time. Now, I wanted to adopt an inmate because beyond 60 days in I just wanted to connect with another woman as far as like being a support system I feel like sometimes we tend to be against each other rather than supporting each other and the specific inmate that I chose to sponsor I'm not going to say her name just out of respect for her but the specific inmate that I chose a sponsor that's at Henry County Jail had a little cameo on the show and I really, really admired her. She was very wise beyond her years and just very, I really respected her just from what I saw with those small clips from the show. So we've connected, I've emailed her a few times and we actually have a video visit set up for tomorrow. So I'm pretty excited about that. And I'm hoping to send her some books and just be a support, whatever really she wants. Like if she wants motivational stuff, I'll send her motivational stuff. If she just wants someone to vent to once in a while, I'm more than willing to do that. I don't know how long she's going to be locked up for. So that's going to play a factor too about how long I will be able to support her at the jail. I'm hoping that I can give her some motivation. I've never been locked up. I don't know what it's like to be in jail and be away from your family in those circumstances. So I won't be able to relate, but I will be able to have empathy and just listen. Because sometimes I feel like these inmates, they're not getting counseling. They're not getting the type of mental support that they really should be getting. So sometimes just having someone to vent to, even if it's only in a 15 minute video call, may do wonders for her and may totally set the tone for her week or for her month. So I wanted to share that with all of you to also say that if you have interest in adopting an inmate, check out my friend Ro. She has a link and it's in the description of this video and you can click on that link, reach out to her. She is doing a lot of hard work to connect these women with supportive people and multiple people can sponsor the same individual as well. So if there's someone that you think would be a good fit um, and they already have someone supporting them, you can still support them as well. So um, definitely check out the link in the description of this video. And yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys today. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for more videos on this channel.